Hey, what's up? It's John Kizzy. You know who is he. Here with another review delivered via Uber Eats. And this time I try in a new place and it's called Winging It. And it's located on the Bedford Highway. And I'll tell you, this place is so new that when I tried to order, they had to call me twice because apparently it's their opening day today. And they were training people, so they run a little, a little behind. But the reason that they called me is um, because they didn't have two items on the list that I ordered. First, I ordered um, the first item that I ordered that they didn't have, I should say, was duck wings. Um, I like chicken wings, so I want to try duck wings and see what they were like. Unfortunately, they didn't have any. So I got some chicken wings. And then I got another call because the sauce I ordered, they were missing a component. Apparently, the sauce I ordered had some taco mix in it, and they didn't have any. So they suggested one that had Cajun instead. So I went with that. So um, while I know the poutine I got, because I did get wings and a poutine, I am not sure what kind of sauce I got, as I forget, and they had to replace one of it so i don't even know what i got but i'll still tell you if it's good i'll try and do some research put it on the screen if i can find what the sauce that they gave me instead was so um yeah anyways before i begin make sure to like share and subscribe and don't forget to turn on notifications so you don't miss any videos in the future all right first things first gonna open it up see what the packaging's like all right here we go here's the packaging uh, they gave you some wet naps, some ketchup, two forks, um, some napkins, and these are the wings. It says uh, single. I guess that I don't know what single means, but that's how their portions are. They were single, double, and so on. And RVW is what I ordered, which is Roger Victor Whiskey, is what it stood for. Um, if I can find out what that all includes, I'll put that on the screen right now. See what's all in there, because I, I, I don't know. Um, see what they look like. Look good. Smell amazing. All right, and this is the Kamikaze Poutine. I'll pause for a minute while I put the description in all the ingredients of this poutine on the screen before I open it up and let you guys see what it is. Oh, there you go. You can see the jalapenos, of course. See the chicken. Fries look good, also. All right. Since the kamikaze has their hot sauce on it, I'm gonna try a wink first. Let you know how this it goes. All right, let's see how it tastes. All right, that was very good. The sauce was amazing. You can definitely taste the uh, sweetness of the barbecue. Like that whiskey barbecue, you can tell it's whiskey barbecue sauce. Man, it's good. Wings are very good. As you can see, they're very good size too. Put my hand there as a reference. The wings are very good size. Lightly breaded, definitely recommend. Them. And I'll tell you, more flavors than I could count well I shouldn't say that because I'm going to try and count them and I'll put how many flavors there are on the screen right now I'm not going to list all the flavors I'll just tell you how many they have now like a lot of places some of the flavors are two flavors combined as you know that can create a whole new flavor right I seen that they had donair the different donair like combos on their sauces and two so um yeah this is a place I'm going to definitely want to try again and yes definitely recommend for the wings very good wings uh, so they live up to their name winging it all right now on to the poutine i should also say that they have other fry choices as well other than the poutine 
Yeah, they have a ton of options with uh, toppings for fries. Um, this place has a very good extensive menu. Looking forward to trying other stuff on the menu. For now, let me see. That. See, I got the jalapeno on there. Let's see if I can get a piece of chicken. Yep, there we go. There we go. Got a little bit of everything. See that? All right, let's try it and see how it is. Oh, it's very good. Very spicy. Uh, at first I was gonna say that it's not that spicy. It was just a jalapeno. But, the more I talk, the spicier it's getting. That sauce is, creeps up on you, kicks in. Sweating from one bite. Yep, I like that. Definitely recommend that for people that like heat. I also say the fries are very good. So if you don't like heat and you want to try some of their other poutines, or even just try some of their like fries, like they, like I said, they have different fry with toppings on it, like uh, cheese and bacon. That's not poutine, because the poutine would be the gravy too, right? But they have all types, all types of different um, fries options on there. Sorry, stuttering my words. Mope was kind of hot. This was hot, but delicious. Do I recommend it? Yes. So all in all, I recommend this place as a whole. Um, only tried two things so far, and they're both amazing. Definitely like them. And uh, I'll tell you this, that when they do have duck wings available, I will order them, and I'll do a review video on that. Probably do a video with that and uh, maybe one of the fries. Uh, I've seen that they have potato skins, but they do the potato boats to carve those shells. That's not how I like my potato skins. I like Nova Scotian pub style potato skins, which just skins almost like nachos. That's my jam. So I'm not going to try the potato skins, but I, I'll pick a side to try when I get the wings as well. So I can review two things because I like to review more than one here. Anyways, all in all, I recommend this place. Go check it out. Now, if you like this video, make sure to like, share, and subscribe. And don't forget to turn on notifications so you don't miss any videos in the future. I'm John Gizzy, you know who is he? Also known as Philly G, because they know who I be. And I'll catch you next time.